The following is a summary of the Holy Father's words this morning. Dear brothers and sisters, in our continuing catechesis on prayer, we now turn to the book of Psalms, which can be considered a great treasury of prayers. The Psalms teach us to pray to God in words that he himself has given us. In them, we encounter the entire gamut of human emotions from praise, petitions, and joyful thanksgiving to anguished supplication for deliverance from life's bitter disappointments and sorrows. The Psalms teach us that God is not deaf to our prayers, especially those that arise from a broken heart and a troubled spirit. The Psalmist's repeated cry, How long, O Lord, is itself an acknowledgement that amid our every trial and tribulation, God hears our voice and never abandons us. As a loving father, he weeps for our sufferings in this world, yet in his wisdom he has a saving plan for each of us. The Psalms are thus a guide to growth in the practice of prayer. They open our hearts to ever deeper hope in God's providential care. They confirm our trust in his promises and they inspire us to persevere on our lifelong journey of faith in his word. The Holy Father will now greet the English-speaking faithful in Italian. Saluto cordialmente i fedeli di lingua inglese. Su di voi e sulle vostre famiglie invoco la gioia e la pace di Cristo. Dio vi benedica. I welcome all the English-speaking pilgrims and visitors who join us for today's audience. Upon you and your families, I invoke the joy and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you. Dominum Hobisum. Et con spiritu tuo. Sin nome Domini Benedictum. Ex hoc nuncatus quae in seculo. Editorium nostrum in nome Domini. Qui feci cerum et terra. Benedica vos omnipotenteus, Pater et Filius et Spiritus Sancti. Amen.